The one who can heal and cast out demons is greater than the one who can only preach. And the one who can prophesy to individuals accurately. You have a son. This is your problem. Your grandmother has polygamy. This is why you have this problem. You have household gods. The one who prophesy individually is greater than the one who only say fire, fire, out, 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 fire, fire. Be healed. And the one who prophesy world events is greater than the one who prophesy to people individually. I'm not talking about general world events. I'm talking about accurate world prophecies. Like what Jeremiah did in the Old Testament. Within 70 years, Babylon will fall and you Jews will come back to worship God in this land. Like Isaiah, within 65 years, Ephraim will be no more. Like the prophet Elisha, woman, go to another land and live because for the land of Israel, there will be famine for seven years. This is world prophecies, not like the people who prophesy world events today. Every week, every week they have three world prophecies. Uh, this is this, this is that. Exodus chapter 20 verse 7. You shall not use the name of the Lord your God in vain. You are now making discernment as world prophecies information as world prophecies there is a difference between the two of them hmm? I mean this is a world prophecy that I now proclaim to you pray for the nation of Korea because I am seeing drought that will cause unrest disturbance both south and north hmm? The North will have a longer period of drought, unrest, disturbance than the South. Okay, meaning, let's just say South three years, North five to six years. The North will have a longer period of drought than the South. Okay, and uh, I see an 18 year old male uh, he will be in relation to this situation so God bless you I will not be able to say more than that uh, this is a world prophecy that now proclaim to you